Yo, my boys. Look, 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 look. We back. Madden 24 just dropped recently. And y'all already know what we're here for. Now, if y'all look at the lineup coming out the gate, we have nobody. I was one of the people who finished a lot of the rookie premiere set. So I was hoping some of those guys would fill in these spots. Well, as you can see, a 74 overall team. You know, I done picked up a couple people. I haven't ran a game yet, except for draft champions just trying to get a feel for it. However, we got 18,750 points. So y'all already know what we're here for today. A pack opening. So let's just get right into it. We're going to go over here to the marketplace. And after looking... At a lot of these offers that are in here, there's nothing crazy, I don't think, yet. But I believe the Pro Platinum bundle is the best way to go. You get about 384 overall elites. I don't know how much they're worth, but we just need coins right now to build the team. So we're going to go with this. You also get a bunch of 80 pluses as well. So we're going to start with that. And well, I mean, you, you see, you see, you get the 80 pluses. You get the, oh, bunch, of, just a bunch of 80 pluses. Okay. I don't see the 80. Oh, there goes the 84s right there. So that is going to be where we start. And then I also think we should get, after that, we'll probably go Star Elite. And then we'll also go maybe a Headliners pack. Oh, actually, no. We'll probably go with our featured, or no, not the featured, the beginning off. Where is it at? Where is it at? There we go. The weekly Platinum packs, we'll go through the steps with those as well. But we'll start with the bundle first. Coins are the name of the game right now. We need coins to get this going. So, first, we got the 80 plus elite players. We got five of those. So, let's see what we got in here. Hopefully, we pull something good. As the first card is Kenny Moore. Not bad, but definitely not going to play. That's probably just somebody we're going to sell. Second card is Drew Tranquil. Decent. I already got him on the team, though, I believe. Third card, Kirk Cousins. Okay, so, wow, 80-plus. We're kind of just getting 81s. Nothing crazy here. And then Malik Hooker. Now, I hold on. This might be somebody. I'm not going to say he's going to start, but he, he, 81 speed, good zone, 83 acceleration. I mean, we're at the bottom right now, so maybe that's somebody who might get some snaps depending on how things go. We got one more 80 plus. Didn't pull an 82, 83, or anything higher. Drake London is a 6'5 receiver though, with hopefully decent speed. Oh no, 78 speed will not be getting any run on this team. So those are, most of those cards are gonna be sell. Maybe Malik Hooker stays. And now let's get into the elite players that are platinum that we can sell for coins. Number one, Tony Pollard. Okay, that's pretty huge. He goes for 57,000. Okay, so the 83 go for 57,000. We keep on that track. We might have some real coins that we can do something to it. Next, DK Metcalf, another 83, another 57,000 coins. Okay, okay. Oh, did I click it too fast? Oh, I didn't click it. Okay, there we go. James Bradbury. Okay, so now we're coming back down to earth a little bit. That's an 81 or 82. I think it was 81, right? 81? Did I forget it that fast? Young Hoku. Not bad, but not great. We're still going to get well over like 300K though, probably. Which is going to help a lot, which is building a team. As we get another 83 with Tua, another 57,000 coins. I mean, maybe we're well over 400, 500 if we keep this pace up. Next, we got Fletcher. God, the 83s are flying out of here. Oh, this is huge. This is going to be huge for building the team, man. Now, we're not going to spend all these coins in one spot, obviously. You know, I know there's some pretty good cards out there. Tariq Wolin. Things of that nature. Tyreek Hill. You got the Lamar Jackson. Fastest quarterback in the game. Like, we're not going to spend it all in one place. I would like to get a well-rounded roster before we get online and start beating some heads in. As we also put Taylor Rapp. Like, these cards. I, I mean... I mean, the 83s are what really helped, right? We got six more of these. Let's see what else we got in here. Mitch Wisnowski. I think I said that right. Punter, 81. Okay, so it looks like 400K is going to be where we probably end up at, if I'm not mistaken. Ooh, maybe over. You know, we get some 83s. It's Matt Gay right there. Who else we got? 
83 DJ. Okay, so maybe 500K. Maybe 500K is where we are. Oh, yeah, definitely 500K. I didn't think we'd get there. It looked like we were going to be stopped a little short. But Tyler Bass, check. I feel like we got pretty good luck as we got like a good amount of 83s. 57,000 each. Oh, and then I 84 right there, which is 90,000, which is going to get us to just about 600K in coins. Ugh. Okay, so that's that's actually a great way to start. Six hundred thousand coins, and now we got the eighty-four pluses. Hopefully, these are some cards that can actually start on the team. That would be ideal. Zadarius Smith. Okay, a pass rusher. That's not necessarily terrible, right? We gonna need some people who can hit the quarterback. Next, Quinn Williams is definitely our starting D tackle. That's perfect. And then as the last card, who do we got? Justin Simmons. Ooh. Let's look at the stats. 82, decent man, decent. Th this is probably our starting safety. Like, if I had to guess right off the bat, this is our starting safety. I'm going to just promote him to starter now. I mean, he's not the fastest, but he's got some good coverage skills and is about 6'2". That's not bad. So, now we got 6,000 points left. I told y'all the next thing we're going to do is hop into... Some of these star elite packs probably open about two or three. Like I said, the main thing is we want some starters, so then I don't have to just go and use the coins for them. And Demarcus Lawrence is definitely a starter. 85. Even if we don't keep him, he goes for a good amount of coins. That worked out well. Okay, let's go hit another one of these. That that might be the move right here. That might be the move right here. As we go. Okay, where's our elite? Our elite's at the end. Headliners! Cameron Sutton. Okay. Now, even though he's a headliners player, I've seen this card. That's pretty bad. 81. I mean, 5'11 also. Not ideal for a starting corner. I think you guys already know that. Like, he's got Stonewall as an ability. And even though oh, we're not going to sell him for training, everything should probably go for coins at this point, right? But he's not going to be a starter on this team. Let's go ahead and get the weekly Platinums out the way as well. As you see, what we got here. Malik Hooker. Okay, 81. And, okay, so the gold Platinum players are also in the game this year. I don't think they go for anything crazy. I'm guessing they go for like 10,000, 5,000 coins since they're the lower ones. And then, once again, we're just going to hold on to those guys. I'm going to go through all the steps. And then maybe we go to the headliners packs. Tredavious Ward at 83 is not bad. We get, okay, a couple platinum players. Let's just see what these are worth. Okay, so you got 9,000. And I'm guessing since that's a 78, what are we going down to? Five maybe? Or oh, six. Okay, so 9,000, 6,000. And then we have, I'm going to take, okay, you get the whole pack though. It's not like last year. I was about to say, I'm about to pick one. You get the whole pack. So, Tredavious War will definitely get sold. And then, now we have the big one. Which should be Platinum, Avante Maddox, okay. Elite, 81 Ezra Cleveland. Elite, 80 Cody White here. Elite. Okay, this is actually a lot different. And I'll tell you guys why. You're getting three plat. I just got three platinum coin cards, and it's not like last year where it's fantasy. So that's a good amount of coins, actually. As we go through here, yeah, we just make ninety-four thousand coins off of going through those steps. That is actually huge. My advice: go through those steps, man. I don't know if I just got lucky, but that was another hundred k. Just about. We're not going with either of these only because they'll be B and D. I don't feel like any of these cards are crazy. For those who don't know, you can just hop in here, spend the 2200 and they actually give you a pretty good offense and air it out. And then you can go to Elite No Fly Zone. They'll give you a defense. And it'll give you a good base to start out with. I mean, it's not bad. It's just their BND cards, and I try to stay away from those. We'll open one Headliners pack, and I think we're going to finish off with the Star Elite. Just because they seem to be very good, unless we get something crazy in this headline is packed. Jahai Ward. Brandon Graham might also be a starter at left end. Headliner. Okay, so no, we're not we're not doing that. 
I'm sorry, boys. We're just, we're not, we can't even, I can't even fathom going through those because I don't think you get anything crazy. You get two times 75 plus. It just, it's just not worth it to me at this point. So we're going to go back to the Star Elites and finish off the video with two of these. Honestly, I feel like we did pretty good. 700K to start off with is huge. And we do get Dalvin Thompson. Not crazy. Last pack of the bid. Let's see what we got here. AJ Klein. Elite. And Pat Fryer move. Okay. So, as a review, the main thing was coins, right? That's what we came into this video trying to get coins. Also, as you scroll through here, we're going to go to the binder. Give me a minute. You know, I, 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 I ain't been on here too much. They got the new, you know, UI system. I got to figure out where everything is. But I feel like our biggest pulls, Demarcus Lawrence we got. And I'm not saying he won't start. But that's 100K right there, which was huge. Justin Simmons is going to start, even though I'm sure he's worth a good amount. Quentin Williams as well. So we got 285s. Quentin Williams, another card. He goes for 150K. I mean, you can see. Also, Zadarius Smith is another interesting one as well. He goes for about 40. So the 84s aren't that expensive. It's once you get to the 85, 86, especially for teams like the Dallas Cowboys, might get a theme team going early for some people. And then Quinter Wins is just one of the best D tackles in the game to start. So I'ma say we did pretty good. 700 k boys. First video of Man 24, man. As always, I appreciate all the support. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you knew. We got a long year ahead of us. Y'all know the lineup update is coming once I get all these cards sold, get some new cards in the lineup, and then we hit the gameplay. But without further ado, I'm AJ1K, and I'm out of here, man.